Hey friends, today I'm coming on to share with you uh, my hauls from my vacation down in Florida. Um, I was able to go to Hobby Lobby, Michaels, uh, Dollar Tree, and a Goodwill. Uh, so this is some of the items that I picked up at Hobby Lobby. I did grab this um, vellum here with the vines and flowers. I have not seen this at my local um, Hobby Lobby, so I picked up one of these because I thought this could be used for Halloween crafting. The spring or spring and summer shop, I believe, were both um, clearance down to 70% off, and they had this little red truck with the sunflowers, and this could be used for fall, so I picked this up for fall decor. They had the paper studio items for 70% off. So I picked up some stickers, some sunflowers. This one was in the fall, which was 40% off. Some more sunflowers. Then I grabbed these zoo stickers because I just took my mom to the zoo for her birthday. So I wanted to do a little... Um, Maybe like a little album or a frame or something for her. Then, because we were in Florida, I found these Florida stickers to use in my travel journal. I also picked up these neutral labels. Um, and you have all these different ones in here. So here is the back. I did pull one to use here. This is like a glossy finish, which I didn't realize in the store, but it's not a paper finish. So if you write with your normal pen, it will smear. So you really need to write with like a uh, permanent marker on these and then give it time to dry um, because the one that I used, I smeared it right away. The uh, B Design uh, company was 50% off so I picked up this confetti mix of silicone beads love these here and then I also grabbed these smiley face beads I have not seen either one of these at my dollar or not my dollar tree at my Hobby Lobby so I went ahead and picked those up and the last thing I picked up were these die cuts you get 50 designs two of each for 100 pieces and this is very like woodsy whimsical i thought these would be great for embellishments great for junk journaling you could use different ones like the mushroom and the teapot and the tea saucer for like an alice in wonderland um so i thought these were super cute and you do get two of each design which is nice so that is everything that I grabbed from Hobby Lobby. Then I was able to go to Dollar Tree. So let me share that next. So I was super excited to see that the Dollar Tree where I was was putting out Halloween. So I mostly picked up Halloween and fall items. But they had this Halloween faux leather. And with these tarot cards, which is super cool. I did pick up two of those. Then they had this one that says Ghost, Witches, Boo. And they had a couple other designs, but I only picked up those. They do have a slight smell to them. Very slight smell. Um, so I did just get uh, these three. Then they had um, Returning. I have a couple of these already. The Rub on Transfers. I love that it has Jack Skellington there. And then this one is new to me. I don't think I have this one, but I love the vintage feel of this one. Um, so I picked that up. They had these new glass uh, laboratory uh, flasks. So I did pick up two sets. They are two different sizes, which I did not realize when I grabbed them, but that's okay. I'm going to use these in an upcoming swap. I picked up some ribbons. They had this one with the bats, this one with the spider webs, the black and white, 
and then they had this super cool one that will be great for layering on projects and using it for texture it is like a little spider web but it will be perfect for adding and layering on top of that so i picked up one of those I grabbed some of this fabric I grabbed two of these because they had a couple other designs but I didn't like them as much as I liked this one and um, so I thought this would be perfect for again for journals um, you could take two of these and make like a pillow um, you've got the spider webs, the spiders, the potion bottles, the bats. So, super fun fabric. In the fall section, they have these cute little pumpkins, which could be used for fall or Halloween. And they had this beaded garland here um, that had a little pink tassel at this end and this can hang if you want it to hang um, and it had these sunflower beads on it so I'm going to add this to my tiered tray for the fall I think I might change up this pink tassel and add something else on there but I love that it's got the sunflowers on there I also checked out a couple items in the back to school section they were like getting ready to go back to school i believe like um maybe like on the first or something uh so their back to school stuff was pretty white through like it was picked through and there wasn't a lot left but i was able to find these care bear scented gel pens and i was able to find the good vibes only um page flags and all you need is love page flags i love how neutral these are so i was able to find those so that is everything for my dollar tree haul let me set this aside really quick and i will show you what i got from the goodwill so at the goodwill i found these united states 52 flashcards explore all 52 great states it was only 99 cents and what i love is that of course there was a florida and i'm going to add this in to my travel junk journal so you have florida it shows this and then if you flip it over it tells you a little bit about it abbreviations capital bird um, so what I think I'm going to do is add a little piece of washi here so that it can be flipped and you can see both sides. And it does have all of the other states in here too, which is awesome for travel journals or if you just wanted to do something fun with like a United States uh, junk journal. And the kids section, I found this easy carpentry projects for children. I'm working on my... Um, journal for my home renovation I've been trying to keep like projects before and afters and I thought this was super cool and I could use this in that journal and then I found this really neat book uh, Fritz and the beautiful horses um, so this is just a children's book um, has really pretty pictures um, of the horses so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do um, I originally thought I was going to use the pictures in here for my junk journal, uh, but I have not decided if I want to do that or if I want to pass this book along. Um, but it is super cute and I love the illustrations. So that is everything. All of my like crafty hauls that I picked up on vacation. I picked up a couple shirts and some Funko Pops and other non-crafty items. Um, but I enjoyed going to 
the different stores down there. They were mostly similar to mine up here, but even the Hobby Lobby and Michael's had different things that my store didn't have. So that was awesome being able to find some of those sought after items that my stores don't have. So thanks a lot for stopping by and checking out this video. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Bye.